Alright, let's say you go to apply for a college and you're a little late in the game and all of a sudden you're like, oh my god, how am I going to pay for this? You know, because uh, I've done my research and like 30 grand and up. Wow. This is probably not a surprise to some people, those who you know, went to college like right after school, they had a plan and all that stuff. But I mean, I don't know. Let's say if you want to make money, you know, first and then I guess worry about education later or however you uh, plotted out your life. I don't know. Just, yeah, I figure, you know, let me get a stable job, whatever, and, uh, you know, move on from there. But, um, uh, yeah, there comes a point, you know, that you want to further your education, and, well, let me tell you, it's not cheap. So, yeah, you know, I guess this is why, you know, a lot of students, you know, they have them big, you know, student debt loans they got to pay back and all that other shit. But, um, um, yeah, then you got, you know, government funding. Government money you could use and not to pay back. I don't know. It's just, it's like so much. I mean, why should you have to worry about this stuff if you want a further education? Like, I don't know if this is true, but I heard, like, in other countries, you go for free. Now, whether or not their education is up to par with, you know, the United States, that's saying we're all high and mighty, but, you know, we know what we're doing here. But, and I'm pretty sure so do other countries. I mean, if you notice, a lot of do doctors, a lot of them are foreigners. Just saying. But, um, um, yeah, I mean, uh, it just seems like uh, the government's always trying to put you down, you know? Not in, you know, a sense like that, but I mean, really, they, they, they make it hard for you to achieve your real goals. And it's like, I don't know, it seems like it's getting harder, especially the the longer you wait and, you know, that long stretch of time before you, uh, you know, apply to a college and do all the research and pick it and all this stuff. I don't know. It just seems like it's difficult and um, it's annoying. It is, you know. I don't know. Personally, I think it should be easier. I think colleges should um, be more affordable. You know, I mean, hey, give us a break. We're not all born into uh, wealthy families. And, uh, you know, more options, you know. Just like, uh, you know, our health benefits. I think we should have more options. I think if you work for a company, they shouldn't just limit you to whatever they have to offer. I think they should, you know, broaden the horizons a little bit and uh, be like, oh yeah, you can have this, 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 and that, you know. This is too much, how about this? God forbid, right? You know, especially if you work for a profit company. So, look out, you're done. Yep. See, that's the thing, you know, if companies would, you know better their employee situation, then, you know, they want to be stuck, you know, actually trying to pursue better things and, you know, leave their, uh, you know, their fantastic companies behind. Not saying that every company's fantastic, I'm just saying, you know, no one wants to, you know, stay where they're at for the longest because it's just, it's ridiculous, you know? Who wants to wash pots for the rest of your life? No. People want to own a business. People, you know, although they don't mind working, I'm sure, it's just, um, um, you know, it's just uh, human nature. You know, we thrive to do better. And, um, you can't do that by, you know, working at a dead-end job. It's just, it's hard. And, uh, it's not the people's fault. It's the companies. They should better their employee situation and, you know, thus it you know, relies on that individual whether they want to, you know, maybe do it in associates or a bachelor's degree while working. But, I mean, at the same time, be able to freaking afford everything. That's what it all comes down to. You know, if companies would only, you know, give their employees, you know, you know, raises based on their evaluation, I think, um, um, I don't know, I think the workforce would be a better place. And you would see a lot more graduates. And, uh, that's what I guess on that topic. The other topic is, um, um, been noticing the attitude around the uh, country lately, um, uh, that, you know, I don't give a shit attitude because I'm better than you. I don't know, I don't like it. Call it assholeism. You know, whatever. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's another phrase other people have for it. Um, uh, yeah, you know, we're not all perfect. You know, human is error. We all make mistakes, and um, we all deal with them differently. So, um, uh, yeah, this just goes out to the few, and definitely not the proud, uh, the ones who think, you know, their shit doesn't stink. Well, it does, you know, and um, that's just how it goes, you know. No one is better than anyone. I don't care how well off you are, there's going to be some kind of flaw, and it's always going to be with you. So, you know, all I'm saying is, you know, don't be cocky, that's all.
you know, show them, uh, show some respect. You know, we're all humans here. You know, we all make mistakes. You know, we just try to better ourselves each day. And um, uh, that's all I gotta say about that. So in the long run, if you're a good person, it shows. And just um, um you know, avoid the cockiness. You know, if you're having a bad day, it shit happens. You know, what are you gonna do? But um, uh, we all have bad days, and um, uh, it's just the way of the world. So to, to fix that, we have to fix ourselves, and uh, it's one step at a time. And uh, like I said, you know, it's not just one individual; it's everyone. It's uh, you know, unity. That's what we're lacking, and that's what we need to build a better country, I guess. All right, well, you know. If you guys feel like chiming in some comments on the bottom, please go ahead. But uh, other than that, uh, I hope you enjoy this and you listen. <laughs> Alright, I'm out. Peace.